Is the MLS dead? Is it still possible to find good deals like Fixer Uppers? Well, by Redfin's account, there is. And I'm going to show you through their filter how to actually search for Fixer Uppers. My name is Ariel Herrera with the Analytics Area channel, where we bridge the gap between real estate and technology. I'm a huge geek at reading and trying to understand what's going on currently within market trends. And I love sharing this with you. If you like this type of content, please subscribe as well. Like this video so I know more of what you want to see. All right, let's get started. To make sure we're on the same page, let's start by just defining what is a fixer upper in real estate. And by Redfin's definition, a fixer upper is a home that can be lived in, but needs some maintenance work. So this basically is a property that's priced pretty low at a discount because it maybe needs new flooring, walls painted, maybe new kitchen replaced, or maybe something even more like a foundation. And investors may look for this property so that they can flip it for a profit. Through the resources that I've read about, mostly you can't find good fix and flips through the MLS. You usually have to go to a wholesaler or find some other means like building a list. And if you want to understand how to automate list building, please check out my course, Real Estate List Building Automation, that combines Python, analytics, and automation in order to get metrics at your fingertips. In this article called Mortgage Programs Help Buyers Who Take on Fixer Uppers, we can see some more context below. It states here, the national brokerage Redfin tracks new listings tagged as fixer uppers in the MLS, looking at phrases such as contractor special by description. And it also looks at other phrases such as as is, which definitely comes on a lot when you look at these properties that need some work. So it seems to me here that they're doing some NLP, natural language processing of artificial intelligence in order to read these descriptions and be able to tag them if they're fixer uppers or not. Now, if we go into Redfin site, I actually have a local area within the Brandon Riverview area tagged. And we could see on the right hand side, when we look at filters, there's actually a filter here for fixer uppers only. And I was actually pretty surprised about this. I didn't know it existed as it's not in its competitor sites for Realtor or Zillow. If we click on this, we can actually see there's a lot less properties that show up. And let's click the first one here. If we look at some of the images, it definitely looks like it can be fixed to add some value. The cabinets, look a little bit dated, so do the appliances as well as the kitchen counter. The images are pretty bad as well. We can see there is a nice wall here. There definitely could be work done in the back. So just by pictures, I could see it could probably be a fixer upper. And if we actually look into the description, it says things that just highlighted it right away willing to sell as is, can assign the lawsuit or drop the suit, needs a new roof, cash only buyer. So these are heavy tags that I'm assuming Redfin is picking up to tag this as a fixer upper. Let's look at another property. This one is 11410 Sweet Fern Drive. It has information here with little TLC would be perfect to raise some sort of animals and cash offer only. If we dive into the photos, we could see that the frame of the door does need some work. The paint needs to be redone. There looks to be a lot of patchwork and the kitchen definitely needs to be remodeled if we're looking for a certain type of renter. As well, the bathroom looks like it needs to have some work. So this is definitely in line with fixer upper. Now I'm new to this filter, so I would love to hear your feedback if you've been using it as well to find fixer upper homes and how reliable it actually is. All right, so this was a quick bit of information on how you could find fixer uppers through the MLS. Thanks for watching and please subscribe to our channel.